All right, so to take um, field parameters, which are listed down the left-hand side, about halfway down your site visit sheet, um, the first step you want to do is look through your tub and find your air temperature thermometer. And you want to place that somewhere in the shade so that it can um, settle in on a reading. And while that's happening, um, you can take your water-based field parameters uh, using the YSI meter. And so it comes packed in this case, and the first thing you need to do is attach the probe to the meter part. Uh, it'll be calibrated for you before um, your site visits start for the day. And the pins on the bottom line up with the pins in the probe, and so you just want to sort of carefully get those lined up before you try to attach it. And then you just need to screw the cuff until it connects. Okay, the next step is to replace the calibration cup with the protective covering that the probe needs to take the readings. And so that's stored here in the case as well. And so you just need to change the calibration cup for the protective covering. And now you're ready to deploy the probe in the water. Okay, once you're ready to take your readings, you wanna find a spot in the stream at your site with good flow where you're upstream of any of your teammates who might be disturbing the water. Uh, and you want to gently place the probe in the flow. And then turn it on. And make sure it's running and then you should give it about 10 minutes to settle in on its numbers. Um, and once it's equilibrated, you can write down your readings. So once you've given the probe a few minutes to equilibrate and it seems to be settled on uh, the numbers, you can fill them in on your site visit form. And it's best while you're taking the readings not to disturb the meter because um, jiggling the cord can sometimes um, change the readings that it's getting. So I try to leave it sitting still while I'm writing down the numbers and we have the site visit form set up so that you're uh, more or less copying down the data in order down your data sheet. Once you've written your data on your site visit form, you can put the YSI meter away. Uh, and the first thing you wanna do is replace the um, uh, protective covering with the calibration cup. So carefully remove that and make sure that you're not um, bumping any of the probes. And you want to make sure the calibration cup has just about a quarter of an inch or less of tap water, not DI water, inside. And don't be concerned if it's not um, covering the probes because it's just enough to keep the air inside the cup saturated. Um, then you want to disconnect the probe from the meter. And you can put the meter part back in its designated spot in the case and then protect all the pins on the connection end of the probe with the yellow cap that's included. And then carefully wind up the cord and store it back in the YSI case and you're good to go.